Hello. a little bit about meditation and um, you don't have to be a spiritual person to do meditation you don't have to be of any religion um, you can be a complete atheist if you want you can be anything anybody to enjoy meditation and meditation helps in a lot of different ways I've been meditating for a couple years and um, it's really brought me a lot of peace and it brings a lot of new information, and inspiring ideas, and mostly I would say the biggest thing is the feeling of peace and relaxation, and you don't have anger, and it's a very good thing. <laughs> um, I think if people meditated more, maybe they wouldn't have road rage. <laughs> um, Meditation is awesome. It's a beautiful thing. So, some of the things meditation uh, can be useful for is if you're a creative person, if you're an artist, a musician, all of that to me is art. Music, drawing, whatever. Um, writing, if you're a writer, that's to me an art. Um, if you need new ideas, you're an architect, anything, anything that you come up with creative ideas, meditation can really help a lot. Um, if you have like a, a, like a, a block, um, a creative block where you can't, like I'm having right now, <laughs> just kidding, no, um, um, yeah, I mean if you're just having trouble thinking of something, your next, your next project, um, or words for a song, words for a screenplay or a book, meditation, doing meditation can bring that to you. Um, what it sort of does, without getting too spiritual into it, what it, because I know some of the, you know, spiritual stuff will turn some people off. I'm trying to get real basic here. So, um, it basically gets rid of the junk you know, the monkey mind chatter in your head. These wheels spinning and spinning and, you know, you're just like, oh, I have all this in my head and I just can't, I can't think of anything new. I can't get this idea, this um, image or these words. So what it will do is it will clear out all of the junk and it will allow for this pure, information this, this like like from pure creativity will come to you and <laughs> I haven't been making videos for long so it's weird like I'm watching myself on here it's weird but anyhow <laughs> um, yes it's awesome for creativity and you can you can get visuals or words will come to you ideas that is the key. That is the solution if you have a creative block. So, um, meditation is not difficult. I know when I was younger, I was thinking about getting into meditation. I'm like, how am I going to do that? Um, I don't have time to just sit there and think of nothing. It, how am I going to do that? And how can I just turn off my mind? And that's what I thought for a while. And then, finally... I just dove right into it, and um, I found somebody online, um, my friend James, and he taught me how to do meditation. And, um, yeah, it's been a wonderful thing. So, um, I can give you a couple, um, or actually, I can kind of lead you through a short little meditation, too. That would be a good idea. Um, basically... When I meditate, one thing that really helps is is breathing. 
relaxing, relaxing breathing. Focusing on your breathing, but breathing in and out slowly. Just slowing down your breath. It'll put you in a deeper state. You want to do it with your eyes closed, too. <laughs> you don't have to. Actually, I meditate with my eyes open. If I'm out in public, you know, I'm on a bus or something, nothing to do, I'll meditate. And I'll, well, sometimes I'll close my eyes, but usually I can just keep my eyes open so I can kind of be aware of what's going on. On. Well, actually, you can be aware of where your eyes closed too, but <laughs> that's a different story. <laughs> but um, yeah, um, it's just clearing out your mind. And I've even done that when I'm driving. And no, it's not a bad thing. <laughs> it's just actually, to me, it's better when you're driving and you clear out all the junk because you're not thinking of anything and you are very aware of what's around you when your eyes are open and you're driving. It's very nice. <laughs> but, um, okay, so back to meditation <laughs> techniques. So, um, I usually, because I'll start feeling, once I get into meditation, I'll start feeling these, my thoughts, and um, I sort of pretend that I'm sitting in my head, and I'm kind of w riding these waves of thoughts. Because I can start to feel the thoughts starting to form. So it's like I'm, the thoughts coming in, affecting me. I ride ab above them so that they're not affecting me. So I recognize them as thoughts coming, as these thoughts. But I'm not letting them permeate in, you know, into my recognition. I'm not recognizing, or I'm not, I am recognizing their thoughts, but I'm not... <laughs> Letting them affect me. I'm not paying attention to them. I'm not getting absorbed into the thought. And letting it distract me. That's, I would say that's the key in meditation. is Not getting distracted by these thoughts. Because they'll start taking you off. And then you're like, oh, I'm not in meditation anymore. So. Um, after about 10 or 15 minutes for me. After kind of riding on the waves of thoughts. Then the thoughts will not be coming in as much. There will only be a few. They won't affect me. Eventually, I'll get in a very deep state where I have no thoughts at all. And and that's at the point where images can show up, but they're not my, they're not the thoughts that have been going around in my head bothering me. They're, it's like these new, new beautiful um, ideas and thoughts. Thoughts. They're not thoughts, but they're, it's like pure creative ideas and images and colors. It's very beautiful and it's very peaceful. Sometimes you won't even see anything at all. You'll just feel very relaxed. Sometimes you won't even feel your body anymore. And that is just, that's an amazing feeling. You feel like you're floating off in space somewhere. It's very nice. And hang on here camera moved a little bit <laughs> so so I like to sit Indian style my legs crossed and sometimes I'll, I'll meditate with my feet on the floor too as long as I can um, ground myself so what I do is I, I connect myself to the earth you just imagine your yourself grounding down to mother earth just connecting to earth and you also connect yourself to the cosmos if you're connected in both ways. So that keeps you very centered. Um, that'll help deepen your meditation. And um, so once you close your eyes, well, imagine that sitting in your head and you feel the thoughts, but you're not letting the thoughts affect you. You're writing the thoughts. And all the worries that you've had all day about work, about school, about whatever you have going on tomorrow, or the bills, or whatever, you just let it all go. Just for this 10 minutes, you just totally and completely do not need to worry about that. And that'll give your mind a, a nice break, too. So you get rid of all that junk. You don't have to worry about it. Just don't think about it for now. Just leave it be. It'll, and if you need to think about it, it'll come back later. <laughs> So you're cleaning your mind of all that. Letting go. 
of all thoughts coming in. Any worries, don't think about it, just let it go. Riding above the thoughts. You can concentrate on breathing in if that helps. Breathing in and out, nice and slow. Just letting, letting all the worries and stress totally go. Let's get rid of that. It's not good to hold on to that stuff. Anything that's bothering you today, you just let it go. Don't think about that. Just let that thought go too. <laughs> You'll get distracted by thoughts. It's very interesting once you become conscious of that. Let's let all the thoughts go. You don't have to worry about anything right now. It's okay not to think. But you're obviously still doing okay without thoughts, right? <laughs> you're just you're just as conscious and aware, you're here living and you don't need the thoughts. It's very peaceful to give your mind a rest. You might feel things and you might see things. Sometimes when people start meditation, they'll see colors. And that's always interesting. So just let that be. You don't worry about it. No thoughts at all. No worries. Very peaceful and relaxing. Little thoughts go. Don't think about anything at all. Just relax. Sometimes you might become aware of sensations in your head, like your third eye, your crown, you might feel energy going on. It's very interesting to observe that. Let go of all thoughts. Make sure you're setting up pretty straight too. 